All right, over there we can see a whole bunch of poison parsnips. We'll go take a closer look. It actually looks very similar to Queen Anne's lace, except that the flowers are very yellow compared to the white of the Queen Anne's lace. It's growing wild all over Ontario. Anywhere you see great big fields of yellow flowers, that's probably poison parsnip. Now if you touch it, it might not have much happen, but what happens is the oil gets on you. If the leaves break or anything like that, I wouldn't risk touching it myself, but insects don't seem to have a problem. If I can get that to focus, let's see. Come on, focus, you're making noise for the video. Oh well, not worry about that right now. But yeah, don't get it on you. Poison parsnip will cause blistering and scarring, kind of a lot like uh, poison ivy, but way worse, way worse. It can last for years. Gives you sun sensitivity, you can't go out in the sun unless your arms are covered up or wherever you got the blisters. So yeah, watch out for that. If you see it in your garden, you want to pull it out, use heavy gloves, use long sleeve, rubbery soup, something like what you would use for taking apart chickens or something, some like butcher type of outfit. But whatever you do, don't touch it with your bare hands.